Okay, so now for getting the DC to DC converter back in, first thing you do is get it in this bottom right uh, little bolt there that's attached to the um, 12 volt battery um, bracket there. You're gonna pivot that into, into position here. So we got another uh, bolt here and put a nut back on to this one here and your DC to DC converter should be back in place here and we'll reconnect it all up. Uh, coolant hoses and we should be good to go. Okay, so I have the uh, DC to DC converter uh, pretty much fully wired. Note that these little screws here, don't over torque them, okay? There's don't require a whole lot of torque here, just a, more of a snug, snug tight. Um, and then, uh, so finally, we'll do the, uh, uh, the high voltage uh, lines. Uh, I'm just gonna take the bolt out that, that uh, it needs to go into, so. Slide that up into the this, the, uh, then uh, bolt it a positive line. All right, all right. So we'll do that, and then we'll tighten that with the ten millimeter. Then you'll want to do the, the same with the negative line. be it we've got everything just double check make sure you get uh, your your uh, connections are on there and your tabs are back down you got everything kind of secured okay once you get your dc to dc converter uh reinstalled and reconnected on uh, reverse order you'll want to um uh, reattach the uh, negative terminal to your 12 volt battery uh, so I've done that reattach that there and then the final the last thing uh, it would be to uh, reattach the uh, fireman's loop so just connect that in and then lock it down okay so you want to make sure you put your housing unit back in and then attach the two uh, bolts on each side of it there uh, and then you, you drop this back down there and you can then pop in the filter and then your cover to that there snap that in and don't forget you got two clips here you got one on um, this side and one right in here that goes onto this uh, still uh, this uh, aluminum pipe here uh, and that's all secure and then you can proceed to uh, put your uh, center panel on yeah. right, we'll snap those in place and then your uh, left panel as well got the car together uh, it's turning on it's running um, hear the uh, uh, coolant cycling and uh, it's warming up the battery get out of the vents 116 118 108 you can see it's uh but uh yeah it's feeling nice and warm in here now uh so the ptc heater uh gen 3 replacement uh seems to be a success awesome